Hey guys, welcome to the night show. Yeah, I haven't done this for a little bit, but I can tell you right now that I've got a couple of good stories for you. Okay, so the first one is, okay, so we have this very demented guy who, in his basement, he built a torture chamber. It was soundproof and everything. And he was planning to kidnap children and torture them there. And there'll be like, and I'm sure like, what? Oh, just never mind. What? Why are you talking about this? Well, what makes the story so peculiar is that he shared his plans on social media. Social media of all places. Then somebody just 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 got the cops on him, and they got him. They got him before he could even do any of his plans. Now, when you think about that, if someone hadn't done that, he could have fulfilled his plans, and he he was literally going to to take someone else's child and literally do do crap no. Do who knows what to them. Um, he had items. He had soundproofed. He had a cage. He had an orange jumpsuit. Kid sized. And handcuffs. And this. I don't know. I don't want to tell you what it is. But I will tell you something. It's something. It goes your mouth. They put it around. They strap it around your head. And I'm pretty sure that's so you can't call for help. I'm, that's what they mostly use it for. And and if and for those who are older that are watching this, you know exactly what I'm talking about. So, yeah, and so he got so he got put behind bars where he belongs. He should not even be in civilization. Now that we have, now that we have that out of the way, man, that's a gruesome tale, or horrific tale. Tale. You can tell this guy is going to be, is beyond, or should I say is an extreme pedophile, was going to be an extreme pedophile. But, anyhow... Now the next story I have is is prisons. Prison. There was a story that hit the headlines like like apparently there were some corrupt prison guards that were giving these you know like inmates phones, giving them drugs, like pizzas, money, and there was and it's basically having a they're having a good party in one of their cells. And where did and again, they put it out on social media. This is how this got caught. Again, there are a lot of corrupt prison guards. What are they? And another worst case we had we had these four female off female guards that that this one inmate had impregnated for them and these are literally fatherless children and here are or I'm not gonna say the word or because I want to keep this clean but you know exactly what I'm talking about and if anything this is beyond what you would see, you would believe. In all honesty, when it comes to prison, I don't even think the punishment is good enough. Because most of the time, you just sit in your cell, born out of your mind. But that's not the way just to get it done. <laughs> well, in all honesty... Back in the old days, we had these things called chain gangs, and they, and they helped build roads. 
roads and stuff like that. These prisoners need to work more. And you just got to make it so, so they never want to go back. Because just leaving them, they're born out of their minds, is not always going to help. I think we're letting, letting our, letting, letting prisoners having too much fun these days. But feel free to disagree. But anyhow, thank you all for listening and I'll see you next time.